Yo, what is up guys? I'm here today with a live reaction to JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, Star of the Crusaders, episode 30 and 31. Let's jump right into this. Ixo. You know, it's been a while since I did a reaction video. It's been a month, and let me just tell you guys, it feels good to be back to the JoJo greatness. You know, when I knew I was coming back this Thanksgiving, Kakuin. Yeah, it has to be, yo. It feels good to be back, guys. It feels freaking good. The JoJo greatness. I missed it. Gintama, all the animes I was watching, I missed. We have to get better. Yeah. Damn, that sucks. We're gonna have to wait. You can't even estimate the shit. Damn. We're gonna be here for like six years. All right, not six years, but you know what I mean. Yeah, that's true. Speed wagon, come on. We have the connects, man. We have the connections. You know what I mean? You don't know us? You don't know who we know? Speed wagon? That's like my uncle. You know what I mean? Like, if I got sick, I know speed wagon got me. That's like my uncle. Iggy. <laughs> it feels good to be back. You know, I, I need to stop saying that. I, I just start the video and that's all I'm saying. You know, I'm thinking like, huh, I don't know, I'm thinking like this break, just Jojo and Gintama. Cause you know, I did bring up like I might react to Haikyuu, but you know, there's been like on Twitter great comments saying like, if you do that, like think about it, reacting to Haikyuu and then to stop when school time comes. So you know what I mean? Like I don't want to do that. Like I already started Jojo and Gintama, so might as well watch that. You feel what I'm trying to say? Rather than starting something new, so like this whole break, you're just gonna see Jojo and Gintama greatness. That's the plan. So you know, hopefully we get up there with Jojo and Gintama. Let me just adjust the volume. I want it like a little bit more up. I forgot about this opening. David production. And it feels weird to be back though. You know, I realized that every time like I stop doing YouTube for a while and I come back, like I, I don't know, I get camera shy or something. Like it feels weird to be on camera again. I don't know why. Maybe it's cause it's like before I was used to it, just every day recording, and now I'm not, and I guess that's what's happening. And I have new glasses by the way, if you guys notice. Hmm. Look sore. Wow, that place is ancient. Yeah. Jotaro, I just saw Jotaro. Look at us, look at us, the gang, the gang's back together. Yeah, where is Joseph? Where's my boy Joseph? <laughs> we know him. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell me that's a toilet. What type of toilet is this? <laughs> Ew! What? That's nasty! A wind toilet. Ew, that's disgusting. Hills? 
sand? You gotta wash your butt with sand? Ew! <laughs> what type of place is this? <laughs> I love when he does that. Paul, not if we didn't want to use this bathroom anytime soon. It's like the same thing if you ask me. I know it's not really like that in Egypt. I hope it's not like that. An outlet? This has to be a scam. How, why is there an outlet on a rock in the middle of the bathroom or some shit, you know? Yeah, just leave it alone and let's leave and we won't have no problems. You see and you touch it. You should have just left it alone and I'm just saying. There's an outlet there. Picture it's not there anymore. Oh, it's still there. That's weird though. Or this could be a stand, maybe? That's weird, though. If I was a stand user and I had that type of power, I would feel humiliated. Like, that's a... Look. It is a stand, right? I would be humiliated. What type of shit is this? Mariah. Look at her. She's just chilling. So that is her stand? That's a stupid power! Outlets? How are you gonna defeat us with outlets? Or maybe there's more to it, I don't know. Yeah. They've gotten smarter, too. It's probably because he got electrocuted. But does electricity really mess with that? Look. His arm's like a magnet or something? Maybe the radio's messed up because of his arm? Right? What the heck? I don't get it. What's going on? Is it like stuff are sticking to him? His arm is becoming like magnetic, right? And it's messing with the signal of the radio and shit like that. Hmm. You see now it's working? But is that really a good power? I mean, yeah, like, if I walk and my arm's magnetic, like, a rock will, not a rock, but, like, a knife or something will hurt me. But really, like, what if I dodge it? You know what I mean? But how can you dodge? Oh, shit! My, yo! Nice reflexes I have, though. The poor guy, he was just doing his construction. You know, he didn't mean to get hurt. Damn, the poor man, and we're looking at him like he's like a reckless person, like stop slamming willy-nilly. Oh, you saw how it went through his mouth like that? Oh, snap. <laughs> oh, shit. Jotaro hasn't said a word this episode? Don't you guys see this? All this stuff behind his back and shit. Huh? 
Huh? Wow! It's really messing with him now. He changed the sleeping habit. Cause like the mag, the I don't I don't know what the word was. I was gonna say some big word, but I don't know what I was trying to say. Doesn't he realize this or notice like the shit on his clothes? How do you kill someone with this type of stand? That's what I want to know. I mean, I see like it's like bothersome, like troublesome, but how do you beat someone like this? Like she was gonna like all right now I kind of see like how this stand could be bothersome like you know what I mean but you see he's able to reflect fast like he has fast reflexes oh snap this is gonna wreck us look at that all the knives and sh to hurt look and she was right down there I just saw her like I think it, she's on the escalator with him you know what that means maybe like she has to be close to him for the stand to work or maybe yes that's it yes that's exactly what happened he got stuck to the escalators you know, I was wondering that. I was thinking, like, is it like an escalator with metal and shit? Wait, no, he didn't get stuck? It's getting stronger. What the heck? Please have a heart. She's the enemy, but still, I don't want to see my boy Joseph die like this. Where's, you know, Kakyoin, Paul Naruf, Joe Taro when you need them? Damn. Scream? That's what you need to do. Jotaro! Kakyoin! If it was me, I would scream. Help me! Damn. She's cool? You see how she's- OH MY GOSH! SOMEONE HELP HIM! They wouldn't kill Joseph. They wouldn't. Uh, hopefully, we do it. Can't, if they ever- I don't know. Cause you know, I don't know anymore. With Jojo, they'll kill a character. So you can't oh, be too happy. Look at his hand! It's getting crushed! 
Hurry up, push it. You could have pushed it faster. <sighs> watching why weren't you guys there to push the button wait was that not happening they're like look at this guy he's drunk they're like he's drunk or something <laughs> I would be embarrassed too hmm yeah, we gotta play it off. <laughs> Look, the ashtray. With her stand, it's half and half. Mariah, right? That's her name. The reason why it's half and half is because, look, let's say I'm not next to metal or anything magnetic, I won't get affected. But if I'm in the middle of nowhere with no magnets and shit, speaking of, like, middle of nowhere since we're in Egypt and there's desert and shit, I wouldn't get affected. I'll just, you know... You shouldn't even go after her by yourself knowing your case, you know what I mean? The fact that you're a magnet, it's bad for you. Ladies be bathroom, I was gonna say bedroom, what the heck? Let's go in. What's wrong with it? I mean, I know we're not supposed to go in the girls' bathroom, but if, if this is a situation, I would go. Who wouldn't? Like, you know what I mean? Like, I'll go and be like, where are you? Iggy. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the heck? Secretly eating delicious food. This bathroom is nice? Huh, a nice bathroom? Really? Is it me or like whenever you go to a bathroom in public, like anywhere else, like it's never clean. Is, or is that just me? Like, where I live is just a terrible place and they don't clean the bathrooms. Like, you know, you feel nervous to go to bathrooms and shit because it's never clean and smells. Abdomen up and look. This is, you know, Joseph's life. That's not her. Look, her legs are too fat. That can't be her. That might be her. That looks like a dude. Maybe that's her, right? But what if it's not? But you know, we never seen her face, so she could always just take off her clothes. I mean, not take off her clothes, but take wear something else and we wouldn't know. Uh-oh. Let's see. Picture she's not in any of these stalls. That has to be her, right? Oh my god, not her! Not her. Get out of here, yo! <laughs> Leave the hotel! What the heck? She can barely walk. How did she get down here? What if the 
old lady knows her or some shit. <laughs> I doubt it, but you know, what a coincidence. Oh no, look, she's right here. You know, I really want to see her face. To see how she looks, like her character design, like her facial structures and shit. I like the white hair, that's a number, that's a plus. You know, like characters with white hair, like Kaneki from Tokyo Ghoul and stuff, it's cool. Uh oh. What? What? <laughs> she got us? <laughs> I'm the, how do you look at us? <laughs> we look like fools? <laughs> so that means we're attracted to each other? How can you move like this? She's cool. She's just walking away like, yeah, I just did that. So what's your face? Damn, they're not showing us that next episode. You know, she's strong. I'll give her that. She's not even strong. I don't know, cause you see, this Stan, yeah I'll give it to her, it's different, you know what I mean? This is one thing I love about Stans, they're so diverse and different, you know? There's so many Stans out there, you know there's crazy ones like this one, this one's a crazy Stan, and then there's other ones that are like cool, like for example, Star Planet, Oda 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 Oda, you know you have um, Paul Nuttus, the Silver Chariot, you have Red Magician's Red, Cut your wind stand with Hierophant Green, right? Hierophant Green? Hierophant Green, I think that's how you say it. And Hermit Purple, you know, you have the cool stands. And then you have, like, kind of the weird ones. I mean, this is a cool stand as well, though. Like, it magnifies you, it makes you like a magnet. You know, let me start the episode and talk. Let me not just talk and, you know, let me start the episode so we can at least be moving. Alright, episode 31, let's jump right into this. Let me get it ready, sorry about that. Let me just get everything ready. Ixo! I think I said it kind of late or early. Wait, Ixo. Yeah, I said it a little bit early. <laughs> the old lady, yo! <laughs> She's smart as well like her, her stand you i guess you can say it's strong the fact that it's holding us back like this and you know think about it we could die any second if we weren't as you know what's the word as strong as we were we could have died if it was some random dude he would have died easily she's smart you know she plays it out the way she was able to get abdol to push it as well and become like a magnet a human magnet So you know what guys, this funny thing happened to me a couple days ago. So I was in the car with my dad and we were driving and stuff. And you know, I've always wondered, my dad always gets parking tickets. Not even parking tickets, just tickets for driving. And I always thought to myself, you know what, my dad's a good driver. So why is he always getting tickets and shit? So we were driving, he was driving and I was just sitting in the passenger seat right next to him. And there was this sign, the sign completely, a huge sign. It said, no U-turn. And this is exactly what my dad said to himself. Hey, it says no U-turns, but you know what? I can make the turn. I was there like completely, like I couldn't believe it. I was like, what? It just says no U-turns. What do you mean you can make the turn? So he goes and he does the U-turn. And a couple seconds later, the cops are right behind us. Whoop, 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 whoop. And then they give us a ticket. <laughs> it was funny because it's like, what the heck? The, the sign said no U-turn. And then he blamed me. He said, it's your fault. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny and you know you guys probably don't care and I just told you something you don't care about 
But you know what? It's just something funny that happened to me a couple days ago. We got stopped by the cops. No wonder he gets all those tickets now I know. You know, I was going to be start platinum for Halloween. Like the costume and everything was supposed to come in the mail, but it never did. Like I bought it and everything. I'm calling them all the time, telling them like, where is it? They said it probably got lost in like the mail or some shit. You know what this kind of reminds me of? How they're stuck together? What is it called when you're like in the bag? Not even the bag. When you tie your leg to someone else's leg and you have to hop or some shit like that. Or you have to walk together. Yeah. We can barely move. We, how do you, how will we do this? Look at us, this is the war. Look, he's gonna think like we're perverts or something. <laughs> this guy's like, what's going on here? Watching, everyone's like, oh my gosh, what's gonna happen? <laughs> yeah, get lost. Get out of here, man. Do we want to dance? Let us dance. Now we just have to pull apart, right? I wonder if this would be painful. Cause I mean, you're stuck to this person. Like they're stuck to each other. So if you pull off, like wouldn't that hurt a little bit or something? Good thinking. But wouldn't this hold up? Hold up! I, I hope what I'm thinking, like, or maybe I have a dirt. <laughs> no! <laughs> Pull off, bro! You hurry me up! <laughs> Everyone's watching this shit now. Look at these kids. Where are you guys from? Go to school? They skipped their classes to watch. Oh my god. Wow. They skipped their classes to watch this. At least we broke apart. Running, you could you could barely walk in the hotel. Now you're running and healthy. <laughs> this is the weirdest thing ever. Look at this position. Yeah, we do. What if? But aren't they gonna roll together and collide? She's 
just chilling. You see, like, she, you see, this is one thing I like about her. She's just chilling, smoking, and doing her thing. Like, she's not even breaking a sweat on us when you think about it. Most of the people, not like people, but you know, the other stand users. I mean, they are people, but you know what I mean, the other stand users. Like, they would break a sweat. They were tryhards. But with her, it's like, she doesn't have to do much. Railroad tracks. Oh, snap. Picture a train comes, it's gonna whack us? I doubt a train's gonna... I hope a train doesn't come. You see, she's just chilling, laughing. I like her laugh, too. Oh, no. The thing we least wanted, a train. Chugga, 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 choo-choo. Wait, that, trains don't even go like that? Why? How come you, you know, like, I, was, I always wonder, why did that ever happen? Like, people say, chugga, chugga, choo-choo. Yeah, that's how trains go, like that. Or maybe the old trains used to go like that. Chugga, 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 choo-choo. Yeah, the people in there would die. I mean, who knows, but they would be hurt. So we have, we have to do something. It's, we have to get off the rails without hurting them. Yeah, let's do that. That seems... Oh, look, it's breaking apart. It's already detaching. You see, she's not even... She, she has no worries. She's like, oh, I'm not even... I'm going to let them do what they can do. I'm not even going to kick down the pole. If it was me, I'll kick down the pole and say die. If it was me. Joe Taro, Paul Nadin, please help us or something. You didn't win. We didn't get killed. No, because you didn't see no blood or you didn't hear it. Like, wait, did we? No, we didn't get run over. There's no way. No, that won't, that doesn't make sense. Because if we got run over, I feel the train would have at least made movements. Blood would have been splattered. And we finally saw her face. Nice thinking! They made a hole and then went under it, so it, it didn't really affect the rails. Nice! <laughs> Stop having fun, guys. <laughs> She's gonna kill us. Look at her face. Ew! Why did she make her face like that? This kind of gives us a little space. The fact that we have the rail in there as well. Strangle her, right? She's our enemy. We can't pity her. She, she was ready for us to get crushed and she was laughed. What? How did you do that? How is she making her... Oh, I know what she's doing. She's using the buttons, maybe, to make it look... Yep. All right, I didn't know she had those stuff in there, but... I didn't know about all those nails in there, but... 
I thought she was literally just making her breasts bigger. She's just leaving too? You know, can she not kill us herself? Yeah, that's I realized that as well. Like she stays a certain distance. You see, cause she has magnetic stuff as well. Yep. <clears throat> Let's not give up. We don't give up. We're not quitters. So basically we have her in both ends. Let's hope that. Iggy. Don't you guys kind of think this is suspicious that we're taking this long? It's ironic because they were, were the ones who did it. You know, I have a good question for JoJo as well. Like a JoJo related question for you guys. Only if you want to answer it though. The ring. Wow. Oh, that sucks! <laughs> you know, this is something like a dog would want. If you're a criminal and you steal, this would be the power you want. So you can magnify, you know, magnify and making up words and shit. <laughs> Took his bike? It's slowing us down. Damn. Joseph is strong. Oh. <laughs> Look at the dog. <laughs> the dog was getting strangled. And he's still keeping it up, you know, he's still keeping the pace, or never mind. I was gonna say he's still keeping the pace, but look. But Abdul, he's gonna sweep through, watch. Don't you realize Abdul is gone? Couldn't she just walk forward and we couldn't get her? She's laughing at us? What's so funny? We got you! I like her laugh though. How? How? Why, why am I looking above like an idiot? Electricity? 
It's, that's conductive to metal and shit. Oh, sh damn. I don't know what to say. We're done? She has us cornered, she's right. She's smart. What? What is it? The car! Wow! I'm surprised he didn't spit out blood, cause you know a car just crushed him? Wow, why do we even know what to say? This just looks unbeatable! Thank you. Thanks. Okay, all right. Okay. Like forty years older than her. Oh, yeah, you, Joseph. I'm sorry, man. Lord Deal. I, I, I don't even know. You're my, you know, Joseph is my favorite character. I freaking love Joseph, but Deal. When it comes to Deal. Wow! I hope we don't kill her. Oh, she's done? She's dead? We crushed her up good? I wanted her to live, kinda. Low key, I wanted her to live. A little bit in my heart, I said, you know what? We should let her live. Alive. All right, that's good good Broken bone so she's out of the game You can't recover from that all those bones that broke from her you can tell it's like what every single bone in her Not every single bone, but you know a good amount of her body is broken half of this side. Maybe Nine o'clock a.m. Like what do you mean? You guys finally realized when we finished the enemy. Only if you guys could recognize sooner. <laughs> Who's this guy?
So this is like the He's a shadow guy maybe I mean I'm assuming he has shadow powers Like look Yeah he seems like he has shadow powers So like I guess he thinks So now I guess next episode is just gonna be Jotaro and Paul Nuttif Versus this shadow guy when are we gonna see the Oingo Boingo brothers again? I need to see them, yo. That episode was so humorous when they were in it. Like, it was so funny. I miss those guys. You know, I miss them. And like I said, like, maybe next episode is just gonna be the Shadow Guy. So we're gonna have Paul Nardif and Joe Taro versus the Shadow Guy. And then I'm assuming we're gonna have Abdul and Joseph just in the sidelines. You know, just waiting for them or something. Like, just like this episode. I don't know. But like I said, when, I can't wait to see the Oingo Boingo brothers again if we do meet them again. I mean, I've been told, like, you know, they're important characters to an extent. So I'm hyped. I wanna see them. I'm I'm happy, you know, and yes, we're back on the JoJo greatness. Don't worry, guys, I got you. Doubles are coming out. Doubles, doubles, doubles. You know, Gintama greatness is coming out. And those are the main focuses, you know, this break. And then Christmas break is right around the corner as well. So, you know, I'm coming back for that. Maybe that's when I'm going to watch other animes like Haikyuu. Since Haikyuu is supposed to be only 10 episodes, I don't remember. But yes, I also had a question for you guys. If you had, you know, like, if you could be in any JoJo character, for example, like you could go into them and be the character with the knowledge you currently have of the Jojo anime Who would you pick so like for example, you know Caesar and how Caesar died if I could go back I would go back into Joseph, right? And I would stop the whole argument with Caesar. And let's just say if I couldn't stop the argument and Caesar anyway goes, I wouldn't let him go by himself because we know that's how the way he died, you know, you feel me? So I wouldn't let him go. So that's what I would do. So what would you do? Like I was talking to someone on Twitter about this, you know, a JoJo fan as well. And it was fun. It was a good topic. So I want to know what you guys think. What do you guys think about this? And what, who would you pick? You don't have to answer if you don't want to. But, you know, what do you guys think? Thank you for watching. If you made it to the end, you're amazing. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Peace out.